All right, first of all, here with Tiny Moala and uh, Puka, Lo Puka Lopa. And uh, first of all, I just want to ask you know, what it's like to, to, to be able to dominate a team the way that you guys did, even with making a lot of the mistakes you guys made. Um, feels great, uh, but you know, all those mistakes uh, will, will be really bad in a big game, like in the playoffs or a state championship game. So we really need to work on that, uh, that's my opinion. Now you had 10 tackles here tonight, but it, it, it seems like, uh, and it's probably going to be happening the entire year, where uh, there's not going to be too many runs up the middle. <laughs> Is that pretty safe to say? Um, I don't want to be too cocky, but you know our middle linebackers, you know, we shut it down. Daryl Paulo, uh, Pugalopa shutting down the other side, and uh, we just keep everything in the middle. Puga, what are your thoughts on the game? Man, we, we always work hard. You see how we got penalties and always got a first down out there? It's all work, all hard work through the whole week, and it shows today. But you guys are you're def defending state champions, and, and you guys are playing probably at a higher level than you were actually playing at last year. What, what's, your, what, what's your impression of that? Is that just a perception that might be wrong, or, or do you feel like you guys are playing it better? Uh, I, feel that, I feel that that's kind of right. Um, all summer long, you know, uh, there was practice, and then after that, all the seniors just practice after that. Um, putting in hard work, even though like we're tired and stuff. Uh, when we're fatigued, we still can go 100% no matter what. Uh, as you see the scoreboard is going up. Yeah. We practice for overtime. We don't practice this for four quarters. We practice for the overtime. And just uh, to talk about some of the stuff that, that, that you worked on over the off season and, and in the fall to improve yourself as, as a defensive lineman. We got we got stronger in the weight room, and we try to like use better technique because we really didn't have that much. So they, right. I give it up to our coaches for teaching us everything. All right, so there's there's a few guys on this team, you included, that are kind of considered the Cal connection, like you and Sample <laughs> and, and and eventually Shaq. But you're in Oregon, you kind of like Oregon. Tell us about that. Uh, like <laughs> mischeduling. <laughs> No comment. <laughs> it was a missed schedule. Uh, because he signed up for the camp and then uh Cal offered us to go to the camp the next day. So like he already flew with his uncle paid, over. My there. uncle and them already paid for it, so I was like, man, it's a free ride, so I might as well go. Alright, so that's just that's just something that, yeah. just more internet message board yeah. BS that, that that we see come about. Well just tell us about some of the schools that uh, that you are looking at. Were you part of the group that went to Arizona State? Yeah. And tell us about that visit. Uh, it was it was a uh, nice visit when they beat uh, Portland State. I like how the, the D line uh, coach teaches, like he always gets off the ball. That's how like we kinda play too, so yeah. And what are your plans for the rest of the year as far as taking official visits and uh, seeing some of the schools that have offered you? I think I'm gonna wait until after the season to make my other trip. Are there any schools that you have a pretty good idea that you that you wanna go see and take an official visit to? I think we're gonna I'm gonna go to Oregon State, Washington State, yeah. and then Whoever <laughs> offered me and then they want me to go there. I'll, I'll how about Cal? If they offer me, I'll. All right. I would. How, about, how about you? On what? Oh, well, you, you you took your trip to Arizona State yeah. and just just tell us your thoughts on on that. On, that was your first official visit, correct? Yeah. Uh, definitely the education system. Um, the tutoring is always there. Uh, tutoring, weight room, um, dinner, everything is one building, <laughs> so you don't have to walk across the street or like. Oh, hella far. <laughs> just, it's all in one building. Just take the elevator to breakfast, uh -huh. take the elevator again to the weight room, take the elevator again to study hall. And uh, they really take care of the football players there. Um, they also got awards for academic uh, achievements, and uh, that's what I really like. They can really help us in school. So now you're going to take some other official visits as well. Tell some of the schools that, uh, that you're thinking about going to. Um, I was supposed to go to Florida this Friday, uh, but uh, my mom's coming down and I want to spend time with her. Uh, I haven't seen her in a month. Mama always gets first priority, man. Mama always Family first, first, man. Family first, all the time. Um, but uh, we got a big church function. That's why she's coming down. Okay. And uh, I guess I got to wait for later on for Florida. But uh, other than that, uh, all my official trips will be with Puka, Oregon State, Washington State. Um, our mind and our ideal is just to stay together. Uh, since we grew up together, we might as well finish it off with our lives, too. All right, there there's, had been some talk about the possibility uh, that USC had been recruiting you pretty hard. Is USC really a school that is recruiting you hard, but you're not really considering them that seriously? Oh, no. Uh, USC, you know, their recruiting is, man, they recruit really they hard. They still got a good program. I'll, I'll still go there if anything. <laughs>
Yeah. Is, yeah, have they talked to you about offering? Yeah. They said uh, they're going to wait, though. I got to wait or something. Well, they want to wait to see you play? Yeah. Okay. So, so is there a chance that you might be going to uh, to USC for an official visit at some definitely, point? Definitely, definitely. Uh, USC, you know, our school's got their uh, got their ways of uh, achieving. Like, no matter where we go, if we just keep the same worth ethic and uh, all our academics up, we'll still be good. Well, you guys were very, very impressive. Uh, you know, I've seen, I saw you on TV, saw you today, and, and you guys obviously are having a great time. You get a very close relationship <laughs> you guys have. So, congratulations. Thank you. All right, man.